everyone, Sunshine here. This is a video about how I do my bun. I've got a couple requests from you ladies wanting to know how I do the bun from my first video. My hair care regimen? Well, this is for you ladies. I just finished co-washing my hair. Came out pretty nice, very soft, smooth, fluffy. I conditioner washed with Pantene fortifying treatment. It's very good. This is my first time using it and I must say it left my hair feeling really nice. I used it for about three to five minutes in the shower with a plastic cap, rinsed it out. I did a final rinse with herbal essences, none of your frizzness, smoothing conditioner. I did the scarf method after I rinsed all of these out. I just air dried while well, I put my leave-ins in and as you guys know I use Elasta QP H2 uh, moisture sealing conditioner to leave in. Then I used Neutrogena Triple Moisture Silk Touch Leave In. Very nice. I just used like a quarter size amount, put it on the ends, smooth it over. I love the smell. It smells really good. After that, I moisturized with my Wave Nouveau. Love it. It is so moisturizing. I've tried so many things. I've tried so many moisturizers, but this one helps a lot. Then I used Hot 6 Oil to seal my hair. This is a very good one for you ladies. If you want an oil that has everything combined, this is it. I'm going to leave some hair out in the front. I like it. I just feel like it spices up the hair a little bit more. Instead of... Let me use this comb. I love this comb as well. I use this a lot to detangle. So you come from the roots, I mean from the ends, go all the way up. And I leave that part out. You can also pin curl this part so it can be more curly, wavy for your taste. Let me just twist this for now because it's kind of in the way. Put it up. I like to put it in the middle of my head. Not too low to the nape, but not too low, not too high. Just in the middle. I gotta turn around so you guys can see. You're gonna wanna turn it, push it up, right? Turn it under, keep the ends under, tuck it in. I don't know if you guys saw that. See, you just wrap it around in that circular motion. Get your scrunchie and put it over. That's it. So now we're going to unravel this. And comb it out. We can do some pin curls in the front to make it more fluffy, curly, and just have a little bit more body. So I do about three. I don't know if you guys can see. I start at the top and I do two at the bottom. Oops. There we go. Get that motion going. Secure it with a pin. And then split these in two. Do the same thing. Just roll it up. That's all you do. 
and just secure it with the pin. So as you guys can see, I don't know if you guys can see that, but there's three, one, two, three. You let that set for a while. Okay, so we're gonna take the pin curls out just to see how it turned out. I left it in for about an hour and about 30 minutes, hour, 30 minutes or so, just lounging around the house. And no heat was applied. So you gotta kind of play with it a bit. Kind of got a crease here, but that's okay. Normally I put on one of these headbands. I love them a lot. They tend to spice up the hairstyle, the protective style a lot better. Uh, two alone kind of looks boring to me. I like to put two on. I mean, one alone looks kind of boring. Two looks, you know, just looks more complete to me. I don't know. So I have a, a tendency just to wear two instead of one. So I don't know if you guys can see that. And then I usually use one to flatten down here. I am seven weeks post right now, although it doesn't, like, show because I do the scarf method and it really helps. So all of my new growth here is very flat. I don't know if you guys can see all in here so just play around with the pin curl like with the curls in the front to the way you want it i hope this was informative for you guys i will be back soon with some more videos happy hair growing deuces peace take care